Good morning guys. Today is my first day living here in Tokyo, Japan. I literally brought this suitcase down just to do this intro. But today, um, the agenda is we're going to Asakusa and we're going to Akihabara, which is like the anime capital of Tokyo or in Japan. So yeah, it's really, it's been raining all day. We're gonna make the most of it. Good thing I brought the umbrella that I got from last year. So also I'm still trying to get used to uh, using this camera. So you guys let me know what you guys think of the quality. <laughs> guys, I've been caught in 4K taking a thumbnail. <laughs> All right, we're going on a quick 7-Eleven run okay. with the boys. Hey, they, they, they already went just a second ago, but getting some breakfast. Wait. So the first time you guys went, the purpose was to get like an umbrella, right? And when you came back, Eris, what'd you come back with? Food. <laughs> no umbrella. <laughs> so we got to get um, umbrellas for Eris and Fusion as well. Yo, Fusion, I like your hoodie. Okay. I like your hoodie. But I promise you guys, I'm going to have lots and lots of content for you guys uh, throughout this trip. Just taking it slow right now because, man, that travel day really kicked my butt. It was like 10 hours. No, honestly, it was like an entire day worth of trip. <sighs> What's so funny, Eric? Nothing. <laughs> yeah, basically, when I got back, I just knocked out after, you know, putting on my little makeshift setup. But this entire time, we've been walking the 7-Eleven. It was so quick. And they've got umbrellas right here. I got this one right here, because it's compact. Yeah, we gotta see the price of <laughs> Yeah, true. I'm gonna make a whole video dedicated on 7-Elevens later. But for now, we're just gonna grab some breakfast. It's the first day here. Guys, we gotta run it back to uh, Family Mart, because last year when I came, ooh, there was this strawberry milk that we got every single time. Nothing's gonna ever beat that. Although I do see something right here. I guess I'll try this today. Also, apparently there's a strawberry festival going on until tomorrow, so we might have to go and check it out. I think it's somewhere in Yokohama. Yo, you guys wanna, uh, you guys like strawberries, right? Yeah. You guys wanna go to a strawberry uh, festival? It ends tomorrow. Sure. Okay. Yeah. Uh, you want more milk? Is this cooked salmon or no? Yeah, I'm kinda scared. They have plum crackers or plum chips. I wonder if this is good. A snack video coming soon. Pork flavored chips. You know what? I'm gonna grab one of these. Oh my gosh, guys, I missed the Fami Chikis. We gotta get one of them. Pepper and garlic. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try this. I don't think I've tried the pepper and garlic one. Guys, so all this came out to be like $8, which is, I think it's pretty good. We got pork flavored chips. We got chicken sandwich, got some Ice, the strawberry milk that I want to try. I want to see if it, it's as good as the Family Mart one that I that I had last year. Tuna mayo onigiri. I think I might save this for later. And then last but not least, I think this is what I came to Japan for. I keep saying, guys, I keep saying that I missed the 7-Elevens from Japan and I, and I truly mean it. This is probably not the healthiest, but I don't think I've had the pepper and garlic one, so see how good it is. It's kind of crazy how juicy they can make it. Look at that, guys. You bite into it, it's just instant juice is coming out. Mm. All right, moment of truth. Let's try these chips. These are the pork flavored chips. Eris said they were good. They're good. So. I'm eating balls right now. I'm putting balls in my mouth. <laughs> what? Oh, I still haven't tried those. You haven't tried it? What are they called? Chocolate cream puffs? And you don't have to eat them cold, so I'm gonna try it. Mm. Mmm, I like these. They also have A5 Wagyu chips too. What? Yeah, you didn't know that? Where were they? Not at the, uh, I think it's at Family Mart or Lawson. We should go. I'm gonna go put my ball in my mouth. Bro, <laughs> <laughs> I like it though. Like, you, know, you expect it to be harder, right? Yeah. yeah. It, it just, like, well, light drunk drunk like, All right, so last year uh, at Family Mart, we, we got this, like, really good strawberry milk that tastes just like strawberry haichu. Have you have you had? Oh. Wait, wait. Uh, like my, my brother and I? Oh, uh, you mean on that trip you went two months after me? Hey, that's family. what I'm going to show you today when we go to Family Mart. Okay, okay. I'm going to show you. <laughs> it's super good. Yeah, vlog, you're that? Supposed to be in buying ice all the time. I love ice. I can't. I can't drink anything without ice. You know, if you drink cold, isn't that cold already? Is that cold enough for you? Ooh, yeah. Nah, man. It's, it's gotta be. Enough. It's gotta be ice cold for me. 
Well, all right, this one smells good, but we'll see. Ooh. It's it's strawberry milk. It's gotta be cold or else my throat can't handle it. If it's too warm, my, my throat doesn't like it, it rejects it. <laughs> This one's good. Do you want to try it? I'm not. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, no, no, no. I threw up all of my mouth, bro. All my mouth. Try it. It's not as good as the one I had, though. What do you think, Fusion? Yeah, see? It's sweet, man. Everything's sweet here. Uh, the candy oh. strawberries that you're about to have today, super sweet. Nice, he made it through. <laughs> he was I'm scared. So scared, <laughs> I'm so scared. <laughs> he was like, please don't leave me behind. <laughs> Fusion survived this first train ride. <laughs> we're, we're already here. This is it. This whole place right here. Ooh. Yeah, here we are. We gotta go across though, so right there. Fusion, you ready to try some candy strawberries? First yeah. time? Be good. Not, I'm telling you. I mean, if you don't like super sweet stuff, you won't like it though. How big is it? Like, uh, normal size, but like their strawberries are already like super sweet. So on top of that is sugar. <laughs> we're almost there, I think. I think the line's gonna be crazy. Man, there's more people than there were when I came last year. Yeah. Here we are, the candied strawberries. Look at that. They have like different types of pastries and stuff too. Ah, kore ichi Guys, I'm so excited. It's been a year since I've had this. So this is a white strawberry, normal strawberry. Let's try it. Yo, Fire? you guys have to try it. Hold on. Mm -hmm. I have like a strawberry. Super sweet. <laughs> Fusion, you're gonna love this. All right, here we go. Yeah. Taste test, first time. Super sweet, right? Oh yeah. Fusion, Fusion, you gotta. I need your reaction. <laughs> All right, try it though. What do you think? What do you think? Sweet, right? I wasn't expecting that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Can I eat the last one? Yeah. All right, you pay for it. You. All right, bet, bet, bet. It's like sugar or something. Huh? There's another one over there. You want it? No, no, there's another one where it's like crunchy sugar on it. It's already sweet, huh? All right, we'll get that then. I want to give yeah. you like the original taste. Oh. Ichi, Ichi only has one. I'm just playing so you claim that at this. Yeah. Wanna try a bite? I'm good, baby. Like, I'm waiting until we eat later. There's a really popular uh, melon pop place. You wanna go, Eris? Yeah, we can go, yeah. Alright, it's just right there. They've got pork. I think it's pork. They got onions. It's like a meat croquet or croquet. I don't know what they call it. Croquet. Guys, so we're heading to this super popular melon pond place. I already see a crazy line. This was like one of my brother's favorite places. This was one of my brother's favorite spots when we came last time. I can already smell it. You guys smell it? That's what it is. Look at the line. Last time it wrapped around the entire building, so I'm hoping it's not the same way this time. It might be though. How far does the line go back? I guess we're about to find out. Wait, actually, wait, actually the line stops here. Here we are. Melon pond. I'm gonna try the matcha one this time. Last time I got the vanilla one. Uh, matcha ice cream. Matcha. Oh my gosh, ah. Arigato it's so hard finding garbage cans around here. Finally, finally found one. Oh, I can't wait to have a whole bakery inside. Look at that. Here we go. Matcha ice cream melon pond. My first time trying it. Last time we got vanilla. Wait, you got whipped cream? Yeah. Oh, here we go. All right, let's try it. Mmm, the matcha is so strong. Do you like matcha? No, You want to try it? Come here. I don't like you matcha. Say it's yeah. Alright guys, I'm not. I'll try it. Yeah. Ray has been hyping this up. 
I'm telling you, man. What do you think? Mm. Chocolate, whipped cream. Mm -hmm. Wait, is it ice cream or just whipped cream? Mm -hmm. and then it's, oh, okay. it's so good. My brother's going to be so jealous when he sees this. He's been wanting this for the longest time. Really? Tim like yeah. it a lot? He showed me this spot, actually. One of his favorites. So in Japan, you're not supposed to like walk around and eat. So mm -hmm. that's why you see a lot of people just standing around eat, eating on the sides. Delicious. Melon pond is basically just sugar bread, huh? Yep. Morning I had like balls in my mouth. Now I have a lot of white cream in my mouth. The chocolate cream cream puff balls. Mm -hmm. Do you throw all your pressure? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was so happy when I found the trash cans. This is my first time in Japan where it's like raining a lot. And also it's just super cold. Like me holding out this camera right now, it's so painful because my hand is freezing. But at the end of the day though, I'm having a good time out here. Just waiting for them to grab something from the vending machine. But also I'm testing out this camera. I'm, just, I'm still trying to get used to it. It's the second day using this camera like full time. So far, it's not bad. I think last time when I came to Japan, I didn't go inside of this temple. So let's see what's inside. Oh wait, there's, oh, they're selling charms and stuff in here too. So we're done with this temple and now we're gonna head over to uh, the anime city, Akihabara. It's Eris' favorite city or favorite um, place in Tokyo. I'm hoping to get like gifts and stuff. But guys, my hands are freezing right now. Oh, uh, what? Like cold? Oh, <laughs> he's not used to walking around. Perfect timing. Yeah, we just came down here. The train just got here. All right, we're in Family Mart right now. Uh, where's the where's the strawberry milk? No, please don't tell me they don't have it anymore. Wait, they might not have it anymore. They have this, the yogurt one, but <laughs> I'm actually so sad right now, dude. Oh, there's a there's a the pachinko station. We just got to Don Quixote. We're probably gonna get like gifts and stuff here. This is like Japan's number one department store. It has like eight different floors. You can get like anything here. All right, it's been decided. It's time to gift shop. Every time we show up to Don Quixote, you gotta grab one of these, start picking out a bunch of different things. I got this blueberry flavored one. So I'm gonna try this one. When we get back to the Airbnb. Eris, pose beside your uh, anime waifu. <laughs> It's only the first day here in Japan and I'm already getting my gift shopping out the way. Look at this guys. I got so many things in my basket right now. Look at that. And I'm about to get one thing for my brother. I don't know why, but it feels so light. Looks like it's made out of styrofoam or something. This is only like $4 too. Look, $6.60. I think that's a good deal. And if you have your passport, you don't have to pay taxes on whatever you get here. Ooh. You want to try it? You want to get crepes, Susan? Or you want to do it after we order for This will be my first time getting crepes in Japan if I get it today. My girlfriend loves Evie, so I'm going to get her this. We're currently in the Animate store, which is like one of the most popular like anime stores in Japan. All right, Fusion, you ready to try your uh, first ever KFC in Japan? Truly, it's the same. I have no idea. I've actually never tried it. This is going to be my first time trying KFC in Japan. If, if we actually get something, maybe. Let's see what they have. This is their menu right here. They have garlic and pepper, chicken sandwiches. Dang, it looks like the chicken sandwiches are popular here. So I got a chicken filet meal at KFC. It's actually really small. It's like the size of my palm. And I think this is like a medium drink or a large drink. It's like half the size you get in America. But let's go ahead and try it. I don't know if this is like medium or large, but this is like small or <laughs> extra small in America. Fries are basically the same. I'm not like super hungry, so I just got some, some small. All this came out to 5.50. Dang! It's $3.66 for basically like a whole meal. It's like a little slider, it's like a little chicken slider. I think it's mayo and then lettuce. Fusion got a box of fries. It doesn't look too crispy though. No. I don't know if it's just the location or not, but this isn't like crispy or anything. Honestly, for $3, I can't complain. Sheesh. Uh, like $4. <laughs> I, might, I might get this. It's like Yu-Gi-Oh! 
Oh, it's like a bunch of cards. You can hear it. 25th anniversary. Oh, nice. I'd rather Wait, get this. Just a whole bunch. But probably a bunch of comments. I can take, use that. Yeah. Are those cards though? Are they like this? Yeah. Like? You can hear it. Come on, so we're already here. Because you know? <laughs> you're like, oh, I, I can buy this with a coin. Yeah, like, I got the out. coins in my bag right now, in my pocket. Fusion knows nothing about Yu-Gi-Oh, but he's getting it. I'm getting it because it's only like $2, and then Eris is getting one too. Uh, Railgun card. Oh, nice. All right, guys, we just entered the largest electronic store in Japan. I don't know where everyone else went, but they've got everything you can think of here. Fusion wants like an anime phone case. I think it was more appearance. Yeah, let's look, let's look around. Look at this suitcase, guys. It has Pikachu on it. You can find anything at this store. Where'd they go? Everyone's just lounging around on the gaming chairs. I'm not gonna lie, guys. This store is like a child's dream. Like, I don't know if you guys remember Toys R Us, but this is what it reminds me of. I think it's better. <laughs> yeah. This is like modern day Toys R Us, but in Japan. He's about to become a gamer. I don't know. This, this guy is like a true gamer, so this is definitely up his alley. <laughs> He's so hyped. Fusion would just like play caught on this. Oh my gosh. This game right here changed my life. Shout out Minecraft. Alright guys, so we just got back to the Airbnb and I'm exhausted. And it's only like 3.30, 4 p.m. We've done a lot already. We've been around so many places, but now we're gonna be opening up this random Yu-Gi-Oh box that we bought. Like Fusion, he has no idea what, like <laughs> he didn't even grow up with Yu-Gi-Oh, but he was like, you know what, let's check it out. Let me show you guys. This thing right here was like $3 and shake it. You can hear it, it's pretty heavy too. So Eris, myself, and Fusion, he bought one as well. So we're about to open it up. Oh God. We stopped by 7-Eleven as well. Guys, I should stop eating 7-Eleven so often because- You want to ice me, man. Hey dude, what's wrong with having <laughs> ice? I love drinking things with ice. I don't know. Hey, you guys let me know down below in the comments. Like, do you guys like drinking things with ice? I feel like drinking anything, like even water with ice makes everything so much better. I mean, it's like, like, I get you, but like, yeah, if this, exactly. but if this was already cold, in the is it is this cold? No, it's not. It's not that cold. You've seen commercials, right? They're like, ah, <laughs> they, they drink it with ice. Yeah, it's not. Not. like I, I do like chewing on. <laughs> I feel like me eating Seven Eleven stuff every time is like taking up space of like actual Japanese food I should be trying. <laughs> There's so many places I want to try, guys, and we're gonna get to that. We're gonna get to that. Today is just the first day. I need to recoup. Yeah, you know, recuperate a little bit because I'm I'm pretty messed up right now. <laughs> What's this one? This again. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, so we were just at a card shop and we saw this like Yu Gi Oh! 25, 25th year anniversary thing, and it only cost three dollars. And this thing is heavy, right? It's heavy, I hear so, about it. So yeah. I was like, Yo, uh, Ares, get this thing. And then he's like, You know what? I'll think about it. And I was like, You know what? Three dollars? I have nothing to lose, you know? And then Fusion was like, <laughs> no, Fusion was like, yo, this 500 yen coin, this can buy this? And he was like, all right. Let's bet. Wait, have you ever owned like Yu-Gi-Oh cards? No. Nah, really? Like your first single one. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. And I've got a right. shiny one for what, 50 yen? All right, so we're about to open these up and see what's inside. I mean, English too? I, d I don't know. Like, I literally don't know what's in here. Well, then said it can be Japanese. All right, let's see. Here's the shocking part. It was only 300 yen. Right now, that's literally like a little over $2. No, 500. Yeah, so it's like three dollars. No, just three hundred yen. I paid oh, five hundred yen. Oh shoot! This is three hundred yen. Yo, guys. I lied, guys. It's three hundred yen, which <laughs> so, is like two dollars. Also, mm -hmm. this is the biggest Yu-Gi-Oh hater in the world. <laughs> and, 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 and I got one. <laughs> this is his first ever set of Yu-Gi-Oh cards. He only bought it because it was cheap. All right, All right, here we go. Moment of truth. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. Okay, okay, okay. Holy Bro, it's see, filled. I told, you. I told you. Wait, I feel like it's gonna be all common cards, right? Wait, wait. Let's okay. see if there's any holographic. Whoa. All right, common. Common. <laughs> let's just let's just look through them. Thank you. See if there's any shiny cards. You got like Some these cards right here. Uh -huh. Random, random cards. Oh, okay. They have link cards. I think I think Rage would like this card. I don't know why. He just likes what? designs like this. What? Let me see. Hold up. If, the, if it would focus on not your guys' faces, can you guys look away? <laughs> <laughs> why is it a focusing? It's because Fusion's face. There we go. What are you trying to say about me? Let me see. Okay. All right. All right yeah. Where are you going? Wait, I want to show it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm not going to steal it. Rage like, likes said, designs like that. I like it. Yeah, I like chibi design. 
Nice. All right. Hey! <laughs> you paid two dollars for the whole thing. I know it. It's my card. Where's all my yeah. good cards? Bro, it's three dollars. He's just like, is this one good? good? He thought it was a gamble. I bought a second one. <laughs> oh. All right. Oh wait. Look. Oh, we got pris these. uh, this prism rare, oh. right? You see this? Oh, I'm gonna steal that. <laughs> okay, I don't know if I'm tripping. I swear this is like a new we card got a few too. Shiny ones. That's maybe I won the gamble. <clears throat> maybe I won the gamble fusion. Yeah, maybe. I'm gonna oh, gosh. No. This one's clean, clean. Guys, I think this mystery box was like a, you know, like a luck package to see like who can get all those or something. But out of this entire pack, this was the only one that looked like this. But look, there's like different types of hollows. Editing? I got <laughs> two different, I got three different types of hollows. Editing guys? One like this, one like this, and like a diagonal pattern. Mm -hmm. And then boom, the look at that. So for dinner, we decided on getting gyukatsu. It's a, it's a restaurant where you basically get like a cutlet of beef and then you cook it yourself. Um, I when, when I came to Japan last year, we got it like three, four times because it was just that good. And Eris, he hasn't tried it before, so hopefully he likes it. But yeah, we're going back to that spot. That spot is so nice. It was so close to uh, where we were staying last time. so. It's it's gonna be like good memories. All right, guys, I might have to swap out the camera. <laughs> Cause he hates it whenever I copy him, so sorry, Eris. Gonna do it. Dang, it's coming slowly. This might not even reach this in gate. <laughs> Dang. All right, Eris, you are not gonna regret letting me choose this spot. I'm telling you, you're gonna love it. It's, it's like a food court place, so so we'll go in here and then there's gonna be like so many different food places. <laughs> you had too high of an expectation. Where we're going is uh, this one right here. No, 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 <laughs> no, 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 this right here. I'm telling you, you're gonna love it. All right. All right, come on, come on, hold on. So Fusion is vegetarian, so unfortunately he won't be able to enjoy, you know, the greatness the goodness of gyukatsu. But basically guys, the entire first day here in Japan, I'm like trying to relive all the good memories that I had here. And I'm trying to show my friends too, like the, the best things that I experienced. So let's go. Take a look at this here. But you can get drinks. But basically it's like a combo meal. You get either this, uh, like one, one cutlet, or one and a half cutlet, or two cutlets. Okay. It's just like the different types of uh, amount of meat. Yeah, yeah. Basically, uh, it comes with all this, like rice. Okay, okay. That's it. So you just choose this, this, or this, and then you choose a drink with it if you want. And then you're good. Uh, I'll probably just uh, get one, either one or one and a half. But basically, uh, you cook the meat yourself. All right, Eris, you're gonna cook the the meat on this. I know. My stomach is super happy now. Eris, what would you rate that meal? Oh, trash. Fire. Oh, no, it's 10, 10, 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10? Yeah. Okay. Good thing my recommendation was good. All day, Fusion has been saying my recommendations are trash. They kind of are, but what? Man. I got lucky, okay. <laughs> but now we're going to uh, Fusion's favorite restaurant in Japan, McDonald's. <laughs> you can only get in Japan. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have more chips. <laughs> He's hungry. I'm so tired, guys. I can't wait to head back to the Airbnb and just knock out. And then I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, here we go. All right, so Fusion has been hating on me all day for my recommendations. So I miss these, guys. These were like one of my favorite like uh, dessert snacks from 7-Eleven. I have, I have a question. If we all have to buy one each, why can we share? 
Well, so so we could have a lot if we like it. Ooh. Because I want This must be your routine. Oh, really? Okay, okay. So basically, they're like frozen grape balls. Cheers. Not the first time I had balls in my mouth, sir. Bite into it. Mmm. Moment of truth. It's cold. Ah, ah. They're so good. Mmm. Mm. That's the best thing you've recommended except uh, let's go. my teeth sting. <laughs> I know, it's so cold. You know, for a little over a dollar. Mm. Alright, fine. Can you get there's, it? There's like a cola one. Too. There's like a cola one. Was it over a dollar? Like 160 yeah, right? There you guys have it. First day living in Japan.